Hey guys, this is Tito back with another unboxing video and today I'll be unboxing this Zip Crosshair Gaming Mouse from Zebronix which is a very affordable option I would say but it has a really unique feature which I'll be talking about in this video. So stay tuned. Cutting the plastic seal, you will get the box contents. Firstly, you will get the QR code. If you scan it, it will redirect you to the user manual. A really good step from the Indian brand Zebronix of going green. Next up, of course, we get the mouse itself with a braided cable and the cable seems really, really solid. And the first impressions of the mouse, I would say it's really light in the hand. And the USB-A ports quality of this particular mouse seems great. It feels solid. In hand feel of the mouse, well, I would say it's a plastic build, but yeah, definitely gives you a really nice feel. And also it offers really cool grips on the sides. On the bottom and top, you will get a lot of honeycomb designs and this empty honeycomb spaces, I would say will help you a lot while you are doing a long, long gaming session and it will actually prevent your hand from sweating as it will offer passive airflow. And the summers are coming guys, get ready for sweating hands with your gaming. And we also get three swappable side grips on this particular mouse and that's again a really unique feature and you won't get that with a lot of mouse in this budget. And these three side mountable grips are magnetic actually so you can swap them easily and definitely it will help you with your gaming ergonomics. And I would say it gives you a completely different feel with each of them magnetically mounted to the sides. I have tried it, I definitely can say that it definitely gives you a different feel but it doesn't change the weight or anything of the mouse. Plugging it into my PC and it turns on the RGB glory of the mouse and just look at that. It looks really really great I would say. Even when comparing it to my old Red Gear A15 mouse that I have been using for a long time now. And definitely I can say on the Zebronix mouse the RGB lights definitely shines and it definitely gives you a much better quality RGB lighting effect I have to say here. There is also a Zebronix software available for this mouse and yes this mouse has a total of 7 keys and 4 of them actually supposed to be customizable I guess. Yes I can control the RGB lights with the software but for some reason for me it didn't work for customizing the key shortcuts like Ctrl S or Ctrl L whatever you set from the user defined section. Well I have tried that, I have applied that, I have restarted my PC, it did not work for me at least on my PC for some reason. It could be because also I have the Red Gear software installed on this PC but later I actually tried uninstalling it but even after that it didn't work on my PC maybe because I had that software installed previously. So yeah if you don't have it I would say maybe clean it would work perfectly but for me it didn't work. So the customizable keys thing on this particular mouse I would say for me for my personal experience I would say it's a hit or miss on this thing but apart from that I tried gaming with it actually Valorant works great over here and I have actually used this mouse for a long time now and for gaming I would say it's a really great option you can change the DPI on fly which might be helpful for FPS gaming of course and definitely I would say it's a really great feature for budget gamers and that works actually keys definitely feel tactile and are really of a good quality so for budget gamers it's still a great option now let's talk about the clear point if you should get it or not. Well if you're someone who is looking for a wired gaming mouse with a really cool looking RGB effect definitely this is the one I will recommend you guys to go for because the RGB on this thing looks really really premium that I have to say. And from time to time gaming and browsing social media whether everything should be working perfectly fine on this particular mouse I feel. I got it as a gift but you can definitely get it from Amazon just for about 500 rupees which makes it a no brainer in my opinion in this particular price bracket. And the link is always present as usual in the description. You can check it out. So that pretty much wraps up this video guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please share this video with your friends if they are looking for a budget gaming mouse. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and that will definitely help my channel out with the YouTube algorithm guys. Subscribe to the channel if you have not yet. This is Tiro from KDNDX signing off for today and I'll be catching you guys in the next one. Bye bye now.